Hi beautiful people, what's going on? So today I'll be telling you five things that you should be doing before you sleep. Now I've been doing these five things daily since last three months and I've noticed changes in my days, in myself and in my attitude. And I guarantee you that if you do these five things daily for 21 days, your mornings would be beautiful, wonderful. So let's start. So number one is maintain a small diary like this or a notepad and jot down your to-do list for your next day. Now, you can also write your to-do list on your calendar if you don't want to maintain a diary. That way your time would be managed wisely and you would be more organized. Try it today, from today onwards, and you'll see the difference. Number two is declutter your surroundings before you sleep. Yes, it's very important to at least, you know, clean your surroundings before you sleep. When you wake up to a clean house, to a clean surroundings, you will be more clear-headed, more clear-minded, and you'll be more focused. I've, I've seriously noted the difference, and that is why I'm sharing this with you. Now, what I do is that I always make sure that I clean my kitchen before I sleep, that I clean all my utensils before I sleep, because that's the first place I enter in the morning. And, I, and I, when I enter a clean kitchen, I get more inviting vibes. And my mood is refreshed. It becomes more positive. So try it. Number three is gratitude. I know there are bad days. I know there are very many shitty days. But even, you know, in a bad day, there is something good. If you're alive, be thankful for that, that you're alive. You know, start counting your blessings. When, when our heart is filled with gratitude, there is no place for anxiety. There is no place for anger. There is no place for unnecessary worries. I'm in the process of training my mind. I'm in the I'm myself in the process of, you know, learning gratitude. So let's all practice that. Number four is read something positive or meditate. If you do not know how to meditate, read something positive. I usually, you know, read a positive short story before I sleep or something, you know, positive. That way I'll sleep with a more positive mind, with a more calm mind rather than being anxious. We should never feel you know, sleep with an anxious mind that seriously affects our next day. And it seriously also affects our subconscious mind. Now I'll make a blog separately, separately, you know, a blog for reprogramming, how to reprogram your subconscious mind. Last but not the least is put your cell phone to sleep as well. Yes. Now what I do is number one, I switch off my Wi-Fi. Number two, I put my cell phone or alarm and I keep it far away on a study table, not really far away, but, you know, away from myself. And it, you know, it really helps me in in sleeping well because, you know, our cell phone, it's it contributes so, to so many morbidities like insomnia, anxiety. So please put your cell phone to rest as well. And these five things would really help you in having happy mornings. If you like my video, leave your comments in the comment section below and see you next time. Bye-bye.